Members of the community say they're disheartened at the bribery allegations. Jen Boniza spoke to residents from the districts that English and Cullen used to represent. The state legislature serves three key purposes to create and pass legislation or laws, to provide executive oversight, and to serve their districts and the citizens within them. The communities that former Representative Cullen and former Senator English represented are disappointed that the people they voted for to serve them violated that trust. The recent allegations of corruption and bribery by the two legislators only add to what some say is an already tainted view of the government. These kinds of things definitely erodes trust amongst the community. I think it makes it harder for our legislat legislators to do their job. Um, and, and right now we need to be going in, in the other direction. Yamashita says it's a distraction and detracts from all of the positive things that lawmakers are doing. Others say it should be taken as a warning. I'm hoping this is going to be a message to whoever else is elected into office about who you really serve and to not be tempted by others to serve yourself. Ritty was shocked, but says English failed the Molokai community long before these allegations surfaced. Uh, we could never figure out what position he would take. Um, and he left us disappointed in many, many ways. Austin McGlinty, who ran against Representative Ty Cullen for District 39, says the news deeply hurt the community. He says it's a violation of the oath and a violation of ethics and an outright violation to voters' trusts. He stands by the communities and stands by any agency willing to pursue investigations into other lawmakers. Yamashita says he hopes something positive will come out of this situation, like creating opportunities for those who truly want to serve. I would like uh, our leadership to look towards our younger generation, raise them up. Let's, you know, let's get them going. Let's, let's, let's put, you know, the people with the good hearts who are close to the people, those are the people we want to serve alongside of us. Jen Boniza, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.